So can you see my uh, PPT uh, presentation? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Good afternoon to all of you. And uh, today I welcome you for this uh, Know Your Library session. And uh, it is conducted mainly because uh, uh, many of you might uh, have already visited library and uh, you know uh, some of the things, but we want to uh, showcase and uh, we can we want to make you understand more about library, uh, both uh, uh, physical as well as uh, digital content, how to access and all that. So uh, this is Dr. Ishapa here and uh, yeah, uh, uh, this library is a is a architectural hub, and it is more than 57 years old. Uh, in uh, 2004, we shifted from uh, uh, this uh, um, clock, to clock tower uh, building was a library uh, when uh, before uh, 2004. And 2004, we shifted to new building. Uh, this is, uh, uh, but our collection and all that, it is more than 57 years old. And uh, we are operating in hybrid mode, uh, uh, means uh, both digital and physical content uh, uh, is extensively available. And uh, uh, we invest a lot of uh, uh, our budget in uh, procuring both digital as well as uh, physical content. So the, all the relevant information you find in this library. And uh, we say that uh, this is one stop for your inform academic information needs. Uh, this is this library is an architectural hub, uh, as I said, uh, because uh, when you see from outside, it j just look like a fort. If you see the cannon halls and all that, uh, it is just a Rajasthani Shekhawati region architecture. And uh, when you enter inside, it uh, it looks like a fort. Uh, you will not understand uh, this is library until you go inside and see the books. So uh, this is this is what uh, the rich experience uh, uh, you will find when you enter the library. So th there are so many spaces apart from your serious reading. Uh, there are uh, sp spaces for uh, your uh, informal uh, sitting. Your uh, that is called central zone where you can have a coffee, tea, and all that, and uh, you can relax for your uh, tired studying and all that. <coughs> it is a green building <coughs> because uh, uh, natural lighting and natural uh, air uh, is uh, plenty here. And uh, we, it is uh, there are a lot of uh, greenery inside the library uh, just to soothe your uh, tired eyes when you uh, uh, do the uh, serious studying inside the library. So about the collection, uh, this is a very uh, we have a more than uh, two lakh books, print books, and uh, it is around sixty five thousand square feet area. And uh, at, at a time around nine fifty students can sit. And uh, we have a ground floor as well as a first floor. Uh, we are subscribing uh, more than 36 uh, online databases, uh, which comprises of 20,600 uh, 20, plus e-journals. And uh, we have also uh, the uh, collection of theses where BITS has awarded around 1,500 uh, theses are available in print form as well as uh, uh, in digital form. So we have around 35,000 bound volumes. These are nothing but uh, the print when uh, one year uh, uh, subscription happens for print journals, we bound them and make them in the form of books and uh, we store them separately as a bound volumes. And the library timing is 9 a.m. to 11.30 usually, but uh, during COVID time, uh, we have made it to 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. from Monday onwards. Uh, these are the new timings. Uh, Sunday and holidays, it is uh, uh, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Today being the national holiday, it is closed. Otherwise, any normal holidays, it is uh, 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Uh, library timings are very dynamic as per your academic needs. Whenever your midterm company exams happen, that time we extend the library 24 by 7 and uh, to just to support your academic needs so that you get a space in the library to read and all that. So these are the entitlement for uh, mainly UG and PG students, uh, the, that is FD, that is first degree students can take 10 books and they can keep them for 20 days and you can renew them for two cycles, uh, that is 20 days um, and 20 days in the form of 20 days and uh, for uh, uh, that is higher degree students, 12 books, 25 days, you can renew them for two times and uh, uh, this year we have introduced a new uh, book collection that is competitive exam, as you all know that uh, uh, bits there are 
are more than uh, 10 students who cleared in IAS recently. So from all three campuses. So uh, it is very, very, uh, uh, I mean, uh, upcoming uh, activity that our students take uh, takes uh, to attend the competitive exam. So uh, to uh, boost that uh, uh, that need, we have created extensive collection on competitive exams. So such books are available in hall number five. Please visit there and you can issue one book at a time and uh, for 15 days. Uh, if you are late in returning the books, library books, uh, please note that there is a, a late fees that is one rupee per book. Uh, and uh, after 15 days, after 15 days of delay, uh, it will become two rupees per day. And all these uh, late fees will be accumulated and uh, uh, charged to your mess bill at the end of the semester. And uh, it will be so I request all of you, please return the books on time or renew them. Uh, renewal is available online. Even in uh, uh, sitting in your uh, hostels, you can renew those library books. And you can even reserve the books. Uh, if a book you are looking is taken by somebody, you reserve that online going to our library catalog. I'll show you that. And uh, you, if you reserve that book, you will get the chance to read that book. And uh, you will be informed once that book's returned to the library. So this is our library layout and uh, uh, the, the, as I said, the ground floor and first floor uh, in the lobby area, we have a AC reading room and uh, uh, new book arrivals in uh, hall number one. Uh, we have uh, reference books as well as recommended textbooks. So these are the textbooks are not lendable. You cannot take them. You can read them and uh, keep them there only. And so that you will get those recommended textbook all the time in the library. So in hall number two and three, you can uh, re uh, you can take them. Uh, you can issue them in the, your name and uh, you, uh, you can take them to the hostel. And hall number four, we have very creative spaces there, uh, like in the form of ideation zone, maker space, uh, multimedia studio. And even there, you will find uh, all thesis, print thesis, uh, research zone for a researchers that is ex uh, exclusively for research scholars uh, scholars and uh, bound volumes are there in hall number 5 you will find competitive exam books children books and uh, you will find uh, plenty of reading space there and uh, hall number 6 in uh, first floor uh, it is uh, uh, you can uh, uh, these are the old books which are less used but these are very useful like your seniors uh, very old seniors must have used them now if any addition change and uh, we keep them separately and in hall number 6 but you will find them useful uh, please uh, browse them whenever you get some time and uh, we have a lobby central area uh, where you can relax you can have a tea coffee and all that uh, very soon we will uh, ask the uh, coffee vendor machine to start his service for uh, you people so uh, this library, which library is a completely technology enabled library where we are, it is uh, fully automated. All over two lakh plus books are uh, automated. They are available online catalog and you can search them. You can see the real time, uh, uh, the status of books, whether it is available or who has taken, if it is taken and all that. And uh, we are using RFID technology for uh, circulation purpose. And uh, it is a uh, library is Wi-Fi enabled, but uh, this facility facility is uh, managed by IPC. Kindly, if you face any problem, please contact uh, IPC people for uh, resolving the issues. And uh, you, even uh, library uh, started the last uh, COVID time, we have started this remote access where even our all the digital content are available outside the campus. So you can even, uh, I will show you step by step how to access those resources. And uh, we have a very interactive library portal that is called InfoBits. And uh, it is very good. Uh, and I will uh, take you through live on that uh, port portal and uh, you will understand the usage of that uh, uh, in the time to come. So, and we have a very good tool that is called OneSearch. Uh, OneSearch is a federated search where uh, this tool will help you to search all the digital content subscribed by the library in one go. So uh, uh, whenever you come across for a writing purpose, any assignments or reports, thesis kind of a thing, please visit this one search. It is available on InfoBits. Uh, it's a very good tool and you can easily uh, filter around and you can get whatever uh, uh, you are looking for. And uh, there are collaborative spaces, as I said, there are a brainstorm room, ideation, these things, you can book them. You can book them online. For, for example, brainstorm room, uh, if you have an uh, uh, event or a discussion with uh, more than 25 students or, or students like a club uh, meetings and all that. So you can book this brainstorm uh, for one hour, you can book at a time. 
and uh, you will be allowed to use that brainstorm room we have a projector there internet connected you, there, there is a sound system and all that so you can use this like a group discussion for a lesser uh, group for example less than eight people you can use group discussion and all that multimedia studio is there for recording and all that you are if you want to record a lecture or a talk just you can uh, book this uh, multimedia studio we have a very high-end uh, camera there you can book that you can use it for a recording purpose then there is a plagiarism checking facility here uh, we are using two different uh, uh, softwares one is uh, uh, original and the second one is Turnitin. So uh, whenever you submit uh, your your uh, uh, your uh, assignments and all that to the faculty, they will check them and they, they will uh, see what uh, how much you have copied from others. So I request all of you please maintain the uh, academic ethics when you are writing. Please do not copy paste. It will be caught and you will be again asked to re rework and uh, resubmit. So to avoid such things, please try to uh, try to write your own things and uh, you can cite. 10% uh, from others and all that so that uh, uh, that uh, requirement I will explain you later so there is a 3d printer uh, there are uh, raspberry pies in the library you can issue them right? exactly and uh, Kindle uh, book readers are there IOTs there are so number so many number of IOTs that is Internet of Things you can use them uh, in our uh, uh, the, the maker space and uh, you can uh, learn more about uh, such uh, instruments uh, uh, not just book and all that you you are also having uh, non book materials uh, for your lending purpose but these things are you should be used within the library there is a pattern traffic manager when you enter the library uh, there you find one uh, kiosk there uh, just scan your barcode id and uh, you can register your entry uh, just select for purpose it will be displayed on your uh, screen and uh, while going just scan and go so it will uh, it will help us to monitor who is visiting what and uh, what kind of uh, resources they are using what facilities are uh, used by the users heavily so that it will help us to plan our uh, future requirements and all that and even for uh, academy uh, like uh, ugc nac related regulation bodies need this kind of data so i request each one of you please uh, make an entry exit as a mandatory kind of thing it just takes hardly to, uh, for five to ten seconds of yours uh, when you enter and exit and we have a multi-touch uh, multi led screen uh, which is there in our uh, uh, multimedia studio where it will act as a whiteboard and uh, it, it is a very high-end uh, monitor we can say that and uh, you uh, you can use it for uh, like a whiteboard and uh, you can have a, uh, collaborations uh, group activities in that room you can book it online uh, there is a project there are so many projectors in the library uh, it's a whole library is a cctv surveillance under cctv surveillance uh, this is our kiosk this is uh, no um, uh, the um, uh, the human intervention in issue return so you will search the books in a catalog uh, you will go to the collection you will bring that book and uh, you can issue at a time 10 books uh, in one go so what you can do is just bring the, those books keep them here uh, here in this space and uh, you can uh, select issue here and uh, you can scan your barcode id which uh, institute has given to you and uh, you can open your account and uh, issue them those uh, books uh, in your name and instantly you will get a email alert saying that these books are issued in your name and uh, you can uh, there is no uh, even a date stamp you can you have to uh, see the see the email and one day before the uh, due date you will get again an email alert saying that book is due next uh, tomorrow you have to renew it online or else you have to return it if you don't do that then there is a late fee so this is what i was talking patron traffic manager so uh, this is available at the entrance of the library so these are the uh, at the lobby area you i mean this is at uh, hall number 1 where uh, these are the faculty publications as well as scientific magazines are displayed there so please read them uh, so that you will be updated uh, what is going on in your field so these are available in hall number one, uh, that is reference section. And even this is in hall number four, these are called bound volumes. Uh, after one year, we bound uh, very important uh, journals and uh, make them as a book form.
uh, I'm talking about uh, three platform library will be using these three platform. One is library portal. That is uh, our website library catalog. Uh, that is uh, for your issue return, searching the books and ebooks and all that. This is called library catalog. Uh, so and the third platform is Shibolic, where it, uh, if you are uh, you want to access the library resources outside the campus, then this platform will help you. So all these three needs different credentials you can uh, i mean uh, not to uh, suggest but you can use the same password for all these platforms so that but uh, platforms are different so kindly uh, make a note that there is no confusion there are three different platforms and three different logins will be there so one is library portal library catalog and shibolith for remote access so if you are inside the campus no need to bother about the shibolith you can only concentrate on these two that is library portal library catalog so uh, this is our library portal. Here you will find a lot of things. These are all available in uh, library uh, within the campus. No need to log in. Just click here and use it. So because all our IPs are integrated these, uh, with these publisher, whosoever we have purchased the content. So uh, uh, this is uh, InfoBits portal. That is library.bits-pilani.ac.in. This is one stop for you all people. You, uh, whenever you get time, please browse this and understand the availability of resources. What are the things uh, uh, made available for you people? So how to do that first time? Uh, so here, if you click here, login first time, if you have not uh, signed up, just click uh, here, login, there will be this uh, page will open and uh, here click on sign up first time, then uh, you can provide these all these uh, uh, the uh, basic require basic information about you and uh, um, email will be sent to you for authentication and uh, you authenticate and start login. So this is our library portal. I'm just going live here. I will I want to show you how it works and all that. So the, when you search here, uh, I'm just clicking. So this page I have already signed up. So I'm just uh, logging in. So as a student, I'm, I have logged in. See, this is the home page, what you get when you log in. So uh, this is connect with library. There are so many uh, the, the things you can contact us online. See, for example, book recommendation. If you are uh, you want to read some books and that book is not there in the, our library, for that you have to check our catalog and then verify. Then you can provide these basic details to us, submit, and uh, your name will come. And because you have logged in, welcome to your name will be there because here I am library. So in, welcome to library, welcome library is there. So uh, no need to put anything, only log in and submit here. Even you can add five books at a time and you can submit. We will take action and we will inform you once we uh, add that book so that you will get a first chance to read that book. Secondly, uh, book not found on the shelf. See, for example, you are searching on catalog and uh, you found that uh, book is available, showing that available, but book not is not there on the shelf. So please provide these details, submit. We Our staff will search that book uh, because uh, uh, request comes to our dashboard and we search it and we will inform you people uh, book has been found. Please Please come and take within two days you have to come and take it because it is kept in your name for two days uh, if you don't come then uh, it will be taken back to the original position uh, so that is so don't just uh, uh, put your request here if you are serious if you are not seriously not found uh, you made all the effort and uh, not still not found then you can place here because uh, our staff will uh, uh, because they are very busy and uh, you if you make them uh, searching all the day then uh, uh, we may not possible to manage so uh, I request you uh, you put all the effort if you don't find then put these uh, uh, needs here and we will work on that and uh, database not accessible database there are so many databases uh, you are accessing uh, uh, from your hostels departments anywhere uh, if you are not able to access then please provide the details submit we will take action and we will c contact the concerned database vendors and uh, we make them uh, to resolve and uh, not happy with the service please uh, select any of these uh, uh, facilities and uh, provide your grievances so we will take grievances very seriously we act them and uh, we will resolve them 
and uh, i just read the bo- this book this is uh, uh, if you, any of you are uh, good readers uh, and you want to say that you have read any book uh, and you want to say that this is a good book and you are recommending for your uh, uh, fellow students then please uh, provide 75 words with the author title and submit here we will uh, this information will be displayed on our library portal and anybody who want to uh, who log in he will see that this book is read by this person and he is recommending these things so kindly do that so that it is uh, uh, it it uh, uh, it uh, uh, helps others to for uh, uh, entailing the reading habit among themselves and uh, you can provide the feedback that is suggestion complaint compliments if you find uh, library is doing very well so please compliment we also it will help us and boost us but uh, we are always uh, uh, request you if you find any complaint any suggestion please don't hesitate put it we will take action so uh, this is about connect with library uh, these are the library services see when you uh, when you have visited library and uh, you lost something and uh, you want to uh, you don't know where you kept so just you click here if uh, the item which you left in the library library st- if library staff found they will make the entry here and if uh, any item is belongs to you please come and collect it we will verify your uh, who is the owner of the item and then we will uh, uh, prov- uh, we will give you that item uh, if for example you have left anything in the library and uh, some uh, students have taken then the, the entries will not be here so uh, only things which library staff found they will enter and you can easily take them if they are belongs to you and there is ill service if you want to read some books from other library you just click here provide the details submit there will be some minimum charges because courier charges and all that so if you are really interested serious about requirement please provide we will get the document like books and all that from other libraries and we will make available for you and uh, free uh, free book to pick this is a very interesting where uh, our senior students have donated many uh, books which after their uh, graduation uh, uh, we have uh, made them a section called free book at to pick uh, just log in there and if you are interested to take this any of this book just pick it up and uh, that book will be given to you and uh, this is a new service uh, this is young learner section where uh, for a staff uh, and uh, faculty children they can uh, um, apply the membership and take that so we have a young learner section a small section where around 3000 books we have kept this is book at my desk this is only for faculty they can rec- uh, request the books to send to their chamber by uh, by filling this form and this is only for faculty uh, se- next section is booking the library space this is very important for your students see as i said brainstorm room just click here reserve and uh, it will ask you which what date and uh, what time what uh, what purpose you are take uh, you are booking this uh, this uh, space and how many people are there and uh, what things you want led project uh, screen sound box uh, sound system and caller mic so all this whatever you check here we will make available for you uh, for during that period so this is for a brainstorm room like group discussion also same thing but the here less than uh, eight people if you are doing then you go for a, a group discussion if it is more than eight people then book this brainstorm room because this is very big room and uh, you can these these things are only for collaborative ex- uh, collaborative activities and uh, the, these are creative spaces uh, like research zone even research zone uh, phd scholar uh, if they are presenting any uh, p- presentation and all that if they can book it and uh, they can use this space innovation zone uh, we have around uh, five uh, computers in the research i mean innovation zone uh, with the simulation softwares installed in that uh, uh, computers you can book those computers and you can use them for your academic purpose like uh, designing and all that uh we have a maker space where 3d printer uh, if you have a prototype to be printed uh, using filament please book this and you can uh, uh, print that and there is uh, if you have any project requirement uh, please book this uh, space even we we have a book uh, that is hpc high performance computer where uh, if you have a high i mean uh, uh, very exhaustive data to be uh, run through and all that that kind of time you can use it this is a very uh, advanced computer we have and uh, we, even we have a uh, iot's in library you can uh, borrow them through library catalog 
so like that multimedia studio you and uh, uh, you want to uh, have a uh, recording and uh, presentation recording and all that you can book it we have a camera and all that we will provide that uh, there is a very interesting uh, space that is called interview e interview carol here if you want to discuss with uh, your uh, uh, and you uh, discuss with uh, about uh, attend the interview or uh, uh, with a um, uh, expert or a uh outside guides and all that so please book this we have a webcam and all that so you can use this space for uh, interview purpose and all that so we have a rare book collection uh, gd birla rare book collection our uh, founder chairman uh, sri gd birla ji uh, has donated his personal collection and uh, we have uh, uh, made a separate collection you can if you are interested to uh, uh, browse any rare book uh, then you please Uh, you visit this you book this and visit this please take uh, good care because these are all very old uh, rare books we don't find in the uh, for a purchase so we can uh, use this uh, space for your academic purpose so this is uh, when you when you log in to the library portal so i am just going without uh, without uh, login see when you uh, go to library.bits-pilani.ac.in this is the home page and uh, when you click here library services you will find uh, daily news daily news what is happening about uh, li- about bits and uh, all those things will be there if you click here that uh, uh, news will open and even periodical finder you can find the e journals what the e journals are there and all that so this you can browse whenever you get some time research aid service this is only for research scholars this is about library service library resources here uh, there are very important uh, resources available for you people uh, for example e books e books when you click here there is a e textbook section here e textbook section just click here there will be a window and uh, you can s- see the complete list of books whatever uh, we have for example uh, uh, ethics and the uh, conduct of business this is a pearson book just you copy this and uh, you search here that book will open and uh, you can go to e library and uh, you have to register here register here and uh, what you can do is uh, you use this code that is institute code uh, for f- one, first time when you registering first time you use this institute code and register and your account will be open and uh, you will uh, get all these pearson books there are uh, 42 pearson books you can add them to your bookshelf and uh, you can uh, access them full text so this is for pearson the same way for example if you are going for uh, magra hill kind of a thing magra hill is a publisher so for example i am just going with the elements of fracture mechanics even here also you can just click here it will open so within the campus no need uh, because if you are outside the campus then you have to use chibolit that i will show you the steps how to uh, how to use these e books so read online just click here and it, the whole book will be open so for that uh, what you need to do is uh, you have to uh, click so click here list of books or else you can s- search here so if you put the title then it will open that and uh, if you want to know uh, user guides how to do that step wise just click here there will be presentations step wise presentations please uh, refer them so that you will get exactly what you want so this is very important things uh, uh, that is ebooks textbooks so uh, many of the textbooks uh, we are unable to add because uh, they are not even available with the publishers so uh, uh, such things we we are uh, we are we are unable to add but most of the things like pearson tmh phi uh, uh, that new age kind of all these uh, publishers books we are uh, we have already added uh, so if you are still facing problem please write to us we will help you and uh, there are old question papers in the our uh, library platform so until uh, 2018 we have uploaded already uploaded 1920 we have requested the concerned department once they give we will upload them also here so if you click first semester you will find the subject wise just click and open and download so these are old question papers and uh, institutional rep- repository like it's a bits, bits uh, repository uh, whatever bits publishes uh, all you will find here uh, you can uh, spend more time on this 
uh, i will go to this is library services library resources and one new service which is very useful to you i think so because uh, this is about your placement and career development for example you are in third year or uh, second year the, you want to understand what is the interview uh, how it goes how to build your cv so in such cases you just go here just for example i am searching interview uh, see there are so many things are available in the form of video in the form of pu chronicle pro pu chronicle is a placement unit chronicle every semester they bring out chronicle uh, which companies they have uh, uh, visited our com our campus how many has been recruited and uh, what is the trend and what are the uh, courses to be uh, need to be uh, taken so all these things you will find in pu chronicles please uh, go through them so that you will understand more about uh, such resources what we have already so even you will if you click here the video will run on uh, work at google uh, prepare for interviews and how we hire so if you click here it video will start so this is uh, your placement related uh, uh, the preparation please visit this this is very important and whenever we come across new resources we go on adding to that and uh, next one is library catalog so library catalog is uh, where you uh, this uh, tool is used for your circulation purpose means uh, whenever you want to take a books from the library you just click here click here library online catalog and this will open and the first time you have to if you know the uh, password and the same password is used for your uh, issue return kiosk that what i show you know the same password will be used here if you don't know the password just click on forgot password uh, put your uh, uh, the, the login id as a first part of your bits email id and uh, your email uh, password uh, uh, when, when you click here it will open so two things it will ask one login and email so login is the first part of your email and email is a bit uh, full email so submit it you will get an email on your uh, uh, email id and uh, you will uh, you uh, can authenticate and you start using that the same password will be used for your uh, issue return purpose so one more thing the catalog what it does for example these are the different types of resources in the library and i'm searching in books for example i'm just going operations research so i'm searching here so like that you can even type here operation research you can type so i'm just uh, i have already so that i'm searching it uh, there will be so many uh, operations research related books uh, in the library i'm just waiting for the result see there are 279 books uh, so uh, here uh, at the left hand side you will see different authors for example i am interested in this man kufman arnold if you are exactly want something then you can see here so i i, I, I this these are the four books kufman arnold has written so i am just opening one and you will get a location for example uh, this book is there in hall number 3 row number 30 and this is the call number see call number is nothing but a subject number each subject in the universe of knowledge has been given a uh, different numbers see this is related to management and uh, we have a, a ddc number that is dv decimal classification uh, where all over the world libraries are using these uh, codes for each subject to arrange the books according to the subject wise so all uh, operation research if you go to 658.51 all operation research even not just kaufman all other uh, authors books will you will find in one place so uh, if you uh, you are going to get a kaufman there but you find the next book is very good uh, on operation research then take that so it is it is helping all of you uh, to see all the uh, content in one go in on one subject in one place so uh, uh, like that and uh, one more thing that you will uh, uh, come to know here whenever you search please note down this number and this location go there and get that book it will be available see for example status is available if it is checked out then uh, it, it shows checked out then you have to reserve that there, there will be reserve when when uh, checked out then you will uh, there is a reservation button will open just reserve that book and uh, whenever this book comes you will get an email saying that book has come please come and collect so otherwise if it is available go to this uh, this this place and get this book and go to kiosk and issue that so this is how uh, circulation will work so uh, as per your entitlement you can issue the books and uh, uh, you can renew them i have already shown you how, how the renewal works uh, i will show you again that 
So this we have already seen when you log in, these things connect with library, library service, this booking will happen and uh, lost and found. And this is a brainstorm room, how to book and the group discussion room. And this is the action. See, when you recommend a book, uh, we take a, whether book is needed, it is what is the cost, if it is uh, very high cost, then we tell the uh, students uh, to uh, connect with the faculty. So the faculty can uh, recommend and we will get only uh, high cost books. Otherwise, we add uh, even uh, students recommendations also. So uh, we have already seen catalog here catalog otherwise you can go to info bits and uh, click here otherwise live uh, libcatalog.bitspilani.ac this is a url for our online catalog and uh, how to uh, reset your password i have already shown so this is the method and uh, how to renew so this is important see when you log into your account uh, uh, when uh, for example this person has taken five books and this is the due date and if it is a uh, uh, due date is not over, then you will get this option that is renew option. Just click here, renew selected. So new uh, new date will be there. If you, uh, for example, if you are not done before that due date, then this option will not be there. You cannot renew online. You have to return that book. Otherwise, the, the late fees will be charged to your account. So as I said, this is a whole universe of uh, knowledge is uh, divided into these subjects for example biology means 570 so uh, these books are uh, arranged in ascending order of the uh, these numbers if you go sub 570 all biology books will be in one place uh, if you go to the 660 chemical engineering books will be there and hall number wise two three so if you go uh, to 660 hall number three, you will find all chemical books in one place, chemistry books in hall number two. So like that, these are arranged. So kindly understand. So these are uh, followed universal. I mean, 90% uh, of the whole uh, library, they are using this uh, system. So this is useful for you people. Other than uh, books, you can even uh, issue return these chess boards, uh, Kindle reading and all that. Uh, so these are non-book, but you can issue them. See, for example, if you are tired reading, so you can issue the chess board and re, uh, uh, play chess and you can return it. And uh, if you want to read books on Kindle, please issue the Kindle. There are more than 2000 uh, uh, non-fiction books uh, on, uh, uh, we have uh, already uploaded in Kindles. Uh, we have three Kindles as of now. So you can issue them, read within camp, within the library. So you have to return while going. So uh, uh, as I said, there is a one search. One search is a, uh, I'm just going live and I will show you one example. For example, I'm searching on machine design. So machine design, there are two different words, machine and design. If you want to search both as a phrase, just put this uh, double invited comma and uh, it will consider them as a uh, phrase otherwise it will search machine differently design differently and you will end up getting unnecessary unwanted things so here whenever you search even google also you can use this methodology put a double invited comma on phrases it will uh, consider it as a phrase and search so i'm just searching this uh, this is one search it is available here very much uh, prominent place uh, on our library portal uh, what i'm getting is these are the results for example there are 159 uh, articles are there. This is available collection. Uh, there is a 2000 to 220 uh, duration. So you can reduce the duration to 2000. So for example, 2010 to 2020, I'm not interested. For example, 2015, just uh, make a, a correction and uh, you just click uh, enter. You will get only uh, 2015 to 2020 uh, the content and uh, you can further uh, filter. That is, you can select peer reviewed so peer reviewed what happens uh, you must be knowing peer reviewed nothing but uh, the expert in the subject will review the content before publishing so whatever peer reviewed means it is uh, gone through a, a very rigorous process of reviewing and it has been uploaded by the publisher or published by the publisher so uh, whenever you are going for academic uh, uh, needs please select this peer reviewed so that you will get very very uh, high uh, standard content for your uh, reference and uh, wh what uh, other things is academic journal there are so many different types of <coughs> resources for example academic journals are there reviews are there so if you just click it only academic journals content will come here 
so that you will exactly get what you want and even subject see uh, machine design is uh, uh, meant for many things so you you will come to know which are the areas this machine design is related so you can uh, even you can just select uh, any of that uh, subject area and you will get uh, the whatever you are looking for you can just download this and you can use it so this is one search one search is a very important tool uh, uh, until you are there in a bits please use this tool very well so that uh, it is a subscribed resource and uh, what it does is it uh, it gives you a very relevant high standard content uh, so i am not against google but google gives you a lot of things which we, you may not need it for academic purpose so avoid using google use this one search so that you will get exactly what you want so this is this is a very important tool for whenever you go for assignments reports kindly uh, make a five uh, six keywords on that topic search here and uh, uh, make a collection of uh, digital content refer them write the assignments and uh, cite them wherever you are referring and you, you when you submit it will become a very standard submission so otherwise uh, 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 the non standard submissions you will be uh, caught in the plagiarism checking again you have to redo and last moment it all makes you uh, stressful uh, no need to uh, bother such things you follow a uh, standard procedures so that you will uh, you will get uh, whatever uh, uh, high standard uh, performance so this is all about uh, online catalog so i have already shown that and uh, this is about online databases see uh, that one search takes all the these resources into consideration and uh, you 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 can also see these uh, department wise for example i am from triple e uh, so what are the resources which are useful to me they they are listed here alphabetically as well as here department wise if you want to see acm related within the campus no need to log in just click here the acm will open uh, that and you can search them and you can download the uh, required uh, uh, articles so this is all about database so uh, recently we have added a joe uh, this is a, a video platform where uh, all labs uh, um, uh, labs and like uh, many labs of your uh, uh, videos are there uh, kindly check here and uh, next week uh, uh, saturday we are organizing one joe training program kindly attend that so that you will understand more about uh, uh, what are the labs uh, and these are all international videos where uh, very high uh, reputed institutes have made their uh, lab videos available on this platform and uh, you will learn more so before going for uh, any lab if you just watch that lab and i mean a video and if you attend it will, you will understand thoroughly so i'm just going back to my presentation so uh, here uh, these are the platform what i have shown you and uh, this is uh, how to sign up our uh, library portal and uh, so here this is uh, you, you can note down please this is one stop for you uh, until you are in bits please use this extensively when you log in these are the facilities you will uh, get it and you can even book whenever you are in the campus please uh, use these spaces in a uh, group activities collaborative activities and uh, you can even recommend suggest and complaint and uh, this is the online catalog i shown you how to search the books and how to uh, reset your password and uh, this is how to renew online so uh, before this date please renew otherwise uh, uh, you will not get the chance to renew then you have to return anyway so to avoid that please renew them and uh, this is how our library uh, collection is arranged physical collection and uh, these are the non book material you can issue return this is one search how to do one search you, i have shown you so the, you can download the full text article you can even on the one search you can see this concept map so for example this uh, example energy is related to so many subfields or sub subjects so uh, whenever you uh, uh, you want to learn about a subject please uh, uh, visit this and uh, search so that that subject is related to what kind of uh, uh, sub subject so it will give you more holistic view on the understanding on a subject so these are the databases uh, which are i have shown you on uh, info bits and uh, this is ebook collection how to uh, sub, uh, how to download uh, read online as well as offline so this is a uh, one example i have already shown you live so this is pearson 
so you are using this code you uh, already it is there on a portal you can also note down this code while uh, registering you just put this code so that uh, you will become part of bits collection so bits collection means uh, you can add these books to your uh, library and you can uh, you can one by one for example this book is uh, your course book then just uh, add to your my library and you can read it online offline both so this this whole collection you can build your own library online library like this and whenever you get the time you can read online offline offline you need to uh, download the apps uh, when you when you click here uh, when you click here so here it will say uh, it will give you a downloadable app downloadable just uh, you can download that app and uh, you can use it so uh, this is a uh, Tata Magra Hill. Uh, within the campus, you uh, uh, you go to that uh, library resources section on the library portal, and uh, you click on the ebooks. And if you uh, there are uh, uh, title-wise links are there, just click there, and you can read. So within the campus, no problem. Outside the campus, you need to sh uh, go to Shibalit. Uh, this is our home page uh, here under ebook section you will find different publisher for example magrahil click here and what happens uh, it will ask you a password and all that uh, that you have to provide and uh, academic writing assistance what libraries provide one uh, uh, this is plagiarism checking facility which is already given to uh, phd scholars as well as uh, faculty members so uh, whenever you submit any articles or uh, uh, assignment they check them so how much you have copied from others so if it is more then they may ask you to rework or resubmit so please to avoid that please do uh, eth ethical uh, act ethical work whenever you uh, are in a writing uh, right uh, requested to write so there is, there are mendeley and note these are reference tools uh, mendeley is and endnote uh, mendeley is a free tool uh, it is elsevier product uh, Mendeley, if you search in uh, Google, you can download it, you can uh, register and uh, you, you will get a space to store all the references and uh, you can uh, use these references when you cite, when you cite your uh, thesis or a report, that time you can, uh, uh, in one, one place you will find all the reference uh, materials and uh, it is available online as well as you can also have a desktop version. And uh, we have a Grammarly access. Uh, so Grammarly is uh, uh, whenever you write any assignment, you just put that uh, assignment in a Grammarly. For that, you need to request us. We will activate your premium version. And uh, then you can use the Grammarly for checking the grammar before submission to any, any uh, assignments or any uh, assessment purpose. So uh, as I said, plagiarism is a, is a very, very big crime. So uh, as an academician, please avoid uh, because uh, it, it, it uh, entails a lot of punishments. Uh, law, law is not uh, accepting uh, if you are copying from somebody and submitting it as a yours. Uh, then uh, there are tools like uh, Turnitin uh, original softwares, which tell uh, the uh, tell the people who uh, from where you have uh, uh, copied and if it is more than 10% then 10% means uh, you have copied something but uh, you have cited them you have cited 10% means very less for example some some uh, quotes are there that kind of a things you have to copy so in that case you have to provide the citation proper citations in your reports so that it is acceptable if, if uh, and that is true it is only just 10% of your report <coughs> if it if it is more than 10% then uh, you need to rework on that so uh, these are this is our uh, remote access platform see if you are not in campus please go to library portal and click on shibalit and you will be getting this uh, home page here if you click on how to access resources you will get guide uh, explained how to do that and all that these are the online databases which i shown you on infobits where within the campus no need to go to this uh, platform uh, outside campus you need to go to this idpb.bits this pilani.ac.in or else click on uh, shibalit you will uh, end up in uh, on this home page and uh, if you click any of these resources what it does it asks you the password so username is uh, for example first degree username is your email id and uh, your uh, password is this whole bits id so you put it login then you will end up in uh, and it will ask this one more authentication just accept it 
and uh, go to the IEEE. For example, the, here it is IEEE or else Science Direct. Any of those resources uh, which are uh, which are listed on this. Uh, Shibboleth platform. These are all linkable. These are all clickable. Just click here and uh, you can provide the uh, username password here and you will end up in uh, on a home page. Here it is written Birla Institute of Technology. Why? Because this is integrated with our uh, subscription. If you go directly, for example, outside the campus, if you go IEEE Explore, you will not get this. So because we have a subscription and you have undergone through Shibboleth and you have used username password, that's why it is uh, giving you this Birla Institute of Technology. Whenever you conduct search, you will get all the full text here. You can go for a HTML or PDF. You just download that and you can get the whole full text available for you. So uh, apart from Shibboleth, Infobits and uh, library catalog, we have one more platform that is called library app. Library app is uh, related to our Infobits. So whenever you want to download, please go to uh, Google Scholar, then uh, type Infobits, you will get this uh, link. You can install it. And uh, when you install and uh, when you log into uh, Infobits, you, uh, Infobits uh, credentials and uh, library app credentials are same. So just log in here and all the resources what we have on Shibboleth, I mean, uh, on Infobits are available on a library app. Just click them and use them. So like this, if you uh, click on a library app Shibboleth, the, our uh, homepage opens and uh, whenever you click any of these resources, it asks you this password and uh, uh, username password, just put that password, then uh, you will be allowed to go to uh, the uh, concerned uh, uh, homepage of the uh, this one, resources, and you can download the articles. So that was another platform that is library app. So uh, next one is uh, we have a physical spaces like eZone. These are the computers with the internet and uh, you can uh, come to the library. Uh, if you don't have a, a laptop, don't worry. Please use these uh, desktops and these are all internet connected. You can down uh, use them for uh, uh, using uh, databases, eBooks and all that. And uh, social media related activities are not allowed. There are more than 28 uh, terminals, both the sites are in the lobby. You will find these desktops. And uh, this is a brainstorm. Uh, where you can book this space online and uh, yeah, up to 25 people you can collaborate, you can have a discussion, you can uh, uh, you can uh, deliberate webinars kind of a thing. You can uh, use this space uh, uh, extensively. And uh, this is a group discussion for a smaller group, like uh, less than eight people, just book it. There is a LED here, even you can make a presentation, you can uh, have a discussion here. Uh, there is, uh, we are not allowing these spaces for your uh, study purpose. Don't book it for a study purpose. Uh, if we come to know that you are just booking it and uh, using it space for the study purpose, then we may uh, block your account. So you will, in the future, you will not uh, get the uh, uh, required booking uh, facility. So here one more, uh, when you enter the lobby area, you are at the right hand side, you will find uh, uh, this AC carols uh, where uh, the, for a serious reading, all uh, it has a, a power plug as well as a, 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 a net port, uh, that is LAN ports are there. So please bring LAN cable whenever you want to use LAN ports. Otherwise, Wi-Fi is enabled here. So uh, uh, you will find enabled uh, Wi-Fi. And uh, uh, if you want to, still you want to use the uh, LAN port, please uh, use, uh, bring the LAN, LAN cord and uh, use them. And uh, as I said, this is a very special collection that is called GD Birla Rare Collection. And uh, these are more than 200 year old books are also there here. So they are very in a bad condition. I mean, a bad, uh, they are not uh, uh, this one, but uh, you still you can, uh, you can browse them, you can use them. And uh, please take extra care whenever you are using such material because uh, they are rare and uh, we cannot find them in the market to replace and all that. And uh, there are so many help desks in the library. Uh, our staffs are very cooperative and helpful, kindly. Don't uh, hesitate to contact any library staff and uh, they will definitely support you. And uh, we are also there and uh, you definitely consider us and uh, you can uh, trust us. So uh, please he don't hesitate to take any help whenever you are in the library. And uh, this is one of the best space. It is a newly created space uh, and it is called BITS Heritage Gallery. So here, uh, as you all know that BITS uh, journey uh, started as a, a small uh, partashala. 
so patashala to uh, institute of eminence how it has uh, grown not just pilani we have a dubai campus goa campus hyderabad campus this is all picture gallery so uh, you will understand uh, the journey of uh, our bits so whenever you get time uh, please visit understand uh, there are so many stories are written here so related to bits and uh, these are very uh, uh, what you can say special uh, kindly visit and uh, whenever you are in, inside the this gallery please take extra care uh, don't touch anything kind and uh, this is for you people and uh, we have a photocopy stationery section on a first floor uh, whenever whenever you are uh, uh, whenever you are in the library uh, uh -huh. Okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Thank you, sir. So, uh, you, stationery. Uh, if you are emergency in need of any stationery, no need to go to uh, the uh, uh, bit scoop and all that. Here you will get a uh, basic stationeries. Uh, you will get a photocopy uh, service. Even printout also you can get it here. Minimal charge charges. All these charges are decided by the university. <coughs> So uh, these are the picture gallery. Uh, please visit library if you are in the campus. Don't hesitate. This is your library. And uh, whenever you find time, please come to library. No need to, <coughs> uh, no need to waste anywhere. Uh, and uh, this library always entails you to help, support, and uh, you can spend quality time in reading, writing, and all that. And uh, these are the very uh, uh, special uh, spaces in the library. And uh, there is a digitization lab. And uh, this is hall number five, very sp uh, special. You can, these are the sofas, no? These are uh, newly made. Kindly, uh, you can sit there, relax, read. Uh, newspapers are there. Kindly use them. So uh, no need to worry. You are. Uh, whenever you face problem in the library please connect with us we are there to help you so a library also conduct a lot of events for the students uh, for example teachers day for every teachers day uh, we used to uh, um, produce the cards and uh, uh, the uh, students used to take them from the library and uh, they used to write their uh, messages as to uh, their favorite teachers and they used to present it on uh, teachers day so teachers used to be uh, used to uh, discuss about how many cards they got from the library so th such uh, uh, connectivity uh, we also uh, take care, take uh, whenever uh, occasion comes so uh, this is a readathon one uh, event uh, one such event uh, where we gave some period like 19th march to uh, 20th april uh, so whosoever read um, more books are uh, have been considered as a readathon winners uh, that is a marathon like a readathon so uh, this is one more uh, event was conducted on uh, word copyright day and uh, that was uh, these uh, the bitsians talked on uh, my vision to make uh, india great so uh, on different topics they have talked and uh, this is an annual event that is called basant book festival uh, in the month of february uh, hope this time also last time we didn't do that we did it on uh, online but uh, this time if all goes well we want to hold this uh, event and make it more special to all of you and uh, uh, not just a book uh, basant book festival we also uh, conduct so many events in, at uh, every evening so uh, whenever you get chance such chance please uh, attend them and this was the uh, workshop, author workshop on uh, 28th September we have conducted. And uh, this is uh, uh, faculty st uh, and staff for children. They were uh, dressed up like uh, Ganapita Awardees and uh, they talked on uh, those Ganapita Awardees, their works, their family, their... Uh, uh, so uh, it was it was very uh, uh, interesting uh, event we had conducted to the uh, faculty and uh, staff children. And uh, this is a competition interesting competition this was a book a bookmark uh, designing competition on a blood donation uh, camp or uh, during blood donation camp and these are the winners of uh, those uh, uh, bookmark competition so this is all why i'm telling because uh, we are connected not just books and uh, information we are connected with you to uh, make your uh, your uh, uh, campus life more interesting so this is one more event uh, that is uh, creative short stories uh, writing competition 
where uh, we gave 10 words different words so uh, the the participant need to use those 10 words in their stories and uh, we have published this aura creative short stories uh, as a, a collection of uh, uh, story book and uh, there are 35 uh, uh, very good stories where, which were uh, vetted by our uh, faculty members who were judges and uh, it is uh, now in a book form so library has published one book for that and uh, these are the contact details uh, for anything please uh, write to us helpdesk.library and uh, or else uh, uh, you can even uh, uh, send your complaint suggestion to the librarian uh, email so we will definitely take all your suggestions uh, your complaints your compliments seriously so kindly uh, don't uh, hesitate please connect with us anytime so thank you all for attending this session and uh, i hope it is uh, useful to you all thank you there are some questions from some of the students uh, they are uh, trying to register on infobits but they are not able to do it uh, okay. the mails are going from them but they are not able to they are, but mail is not going there okay so, so uh, what i'll do sir i'll i'll, I'll suggest them to uh, send that uh, uh, error problem to uh, email what i had helpdesk.library yeah, we will yeah. resolve it on uh, monday uh, without any um, of, uh, without, without fail and also we will inform them uh, what uh, action we have taken uh, yeah uh, dear student just uh, thank you for attending please remember one thing we are sorry for inconvenience uh, because we still we have not received the card. We are using the same ID card, the student ID card as a library card. So until or unless you get the student card, we are not able to issue any books to you. But you are allowed to use our library facilities. You can sit up to late night and you can study. But Sorry for this, uh, we are not able to issue any books. Uh, I hope that uh, recently, in a short period of time, that problem will get solved and you will get the card. Uh, so you. this uh, all your library, I mean, uh, bits uh, card will be distributed by SWD. Uh, please connect with them because they are the one who distributes and uh, uh, the same card will be used as a library card. So for your issue return purpose. So uh, without a card, you will not able to scan and uh, uh, open your account. So there is no manual things here in the library. So you need to have your uh, new card. So, uh, is there any uh, this one queries from anybody? Sir, uh, can we get the replay of this session? Yeah, yeah, we will we will upload that. We'll upload. No problem. Okay. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh, thank thank you. you. See you. Thank you. Thank you all. Uh, yeah, yeah.